It's a big blow to Kerala Chief Minister Pinrai Vijayan. His daughter's petition has now been dismissed by the Karnataka High Court. This was by Exalogic Solutions, the firm that's owned by Pinrai Vijayan's daughter. She had approached the court against an SFIO probe that she uh, that her company faces. In fact, she had claimed that the probe. Uh, by the SFIO was in fact illegal and that it wasn't uh, it was against the principles of natural natural justice but that's a plea that has now been dismissed by the Karnataka High Court Akshara my colleague now joining us getting us more details Akshara what exactly transpired in court what were the arguments that were made uh, when well, you see uh, the wording was supposed to be out today and uh, the High Karnataka High Court Judge Nagakatna has clearly dismissed the case uh, the petition that has been the plea that has been uh, filed by the uh, the company that is owned by Kinrai Vijayan's daughter that uh, there was uh, no need for an SFI uh, you know, investigation and uh, the plea has been now dismissed by the Karnataka High Court so we'll have to uh, wait for the complete word now but I don't know what we are learning is that the plea by Kinrai Vijayan's daughter's company uh, Exologics plea has been dismissed uh, so that means that the SFIO can go ahead and uh, carry out their investigation. They can continue their investigation. Now, remember, the Exologic company had, in fact, opposed the SFIO investigation, stating that uh, it was uh, legal and not right according to the principles of justice. But the Karnataka High Court has clearly dismissed that now. So we'll have to wait and watch how things will pan out. But uh, it really shows that the SFIO could carry out their investigation right now. Right, Akshara, do stay on with us. Uh, Nindu, my colleague, also joining us, getting us more details. There were two parallel investigations that were going on in this particular case, which was the major contention uh, that this petition made, which is why they were seeking relief as far as the SFIO probe goes. But now we're given to understand that both those investigations against uh, this firm are going to continue? Yes, that's correct. And uh, see, politically, this is a case which has been used and uh, will be used against the Chief Minister Pindrai Vijayan because oh, we saw the opposition, especially the Congress, Congress MLA Matthew Kuralnad and himself coming out and stating that uh, this is not just uh, uh, the CM's daughter's company, but this is against the CM also. Now, all this began with the in uh, Income Tax Interim Settlement Board's report. And in that report, it stated that about 1.72 crores was the uh, provided to Veena Vijayan's company, Ixa Logic, um, and uh, monthly deposits were made into the company's account. That's when the opposition has come out and alleged that these are uh, pay the payments uh, have been given, but there is no service that has been given. Now, what the CPM stand was that this was an agreement between a company, between two companies, between CMRL and Ixa Logic, and it has nothing to do with the fact that uh, her father is the chief minister of the state or the politics, and the opposition is trying to bring uh, to tie this to the chief minister that is why they are uh, 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 raising this issue so as far as the SFIO investigation is concerned two, two checks have already been completed uh, at the CMRL and the state run case IDC also so definitely in the coming days this is uh, going to be a political uh, um, uh, issue in the state of Kerala where the CPM will be defending this and the Congress and BJP will be raising this against the chief minister Right. Politically, we're going to be seeing uh, repercussions of this particular uh, case and the investigation that Pindrai Vijayan's daughter's uh, uh, firm faces. At the moment, unfortunately for her, there is going to be no relief as far as the SFI probe goes. We'll keep an eye out on what happens next. For the moment, Akshara and Neetu, thank you so much for getting us the latest.